So we have a few different options for living on campus. We have a traditional hall um, where students can choose to live. Uh, we have a suite style um, in Sweetland where two uh, double rooms are connected by a bathroom. Uh, and then we have an apartment complex, co-ed options, all female, all male, and a gender neutral housing. I've lived on campus for the past three years. So my freshman and sophomore year, I've lived in the traditional halls, uh, which is one of the living and learning communities on campus, um, which was a really good experience. So living and learning communities are specific halls for um, specific majors, and these halls help students uh, build a closer community with their major and also with the students in that major. They can also help each other with homework if they need to, uh, and sometimes they have the same classes. Marshall is a safe community. SMSU is safe, uh, but we do have public safety on campus. Uh, they are on 24 hours, seven days a week, 365 days out of the year, there's somebody available. Um, and then we have resident assistants that do rounds in the evenings um, throughout our residence halls as well. We have a whole bunch of dining options available here on campus. We have uh, soups, then we have specialty items like wings and pizza there. And then we have our food hall, which is our residential dining program. In our dining program, we have everything from omelets for breakfast, lunch, and dinner, along with some scrambled eggs. We even have our home style, which is the traditional favorites like pork chops or meatloaf or any kind of thing that just reminds you of mom's home cooking. For those people looking to eat healthy, we have vegetarian options, vegan options, and we do a variety of different things. When you're living here on campus, I guarantee you have the best restaurant in town right here on this campus.